All right. Let's look at at a, another issue here. I'm tired. It's been a long weekend for me. So, bear with me. I'm trying to get my mind around some of these news articles I've been reading over the weekend. I mean, I'm just kind of tired. I had to go to Mexico. I mean, really fast, uh, like in a heartbeat. I had I had a phone call. It was sort of an, an emergency, and I had to drive down to the border, and it was just God. But here I am. I made it. Uh, no drug cartels were uh, visible that I can see that were a problem. But um, yeah, it's a horrible time right now to live in Mexico, especially in the northern parts where I had to go. But people tell me shit is hitting the fan. People are just dying left and right. Decapitated, uh, dismembered, you have... Um, some guys just have their dicks chopped off and god it was just horrible stories i heard while i was there down in sonora so just be careful if you drive up there or down there or if you fly down there just be careful especially in states like sonora uh sinaloa chihuahua i mean these places are just filled with uh with the drug cartels and mafia but I will one day talk about that. But I had to go down there and um, it wasn't that bad. But still, I had to keep my eyes, my eyes open. So <clears throat> anyway, I want to talk about this news article that I just got right now. And I'm just going to talk about this and I'm going to end the show. I had things to do, but I just want to talk about this really quick. Remember NOM, the National Organization for Marriage, which is started by a guy named Robert George. And Robert George, he's a uh, very interesting guy. He's involved in other organizations and think tanks, all of them conservative, neocons. He's a big Israel supporter. And nothing wrong with Israel, I'm just saying. Uh, this guy has a lot of uh, connections with people who have other interests besides marriage and his big supporter is Peter Thiel who also supports Ron Paul by the way I just want to let you know that Robert George is also friends with the Ron Paul campaign and the campaign for liberty interesting stuff it being the fact that Nam hates Ron Paul because Ron Paul is not really a uh, a big fan of banning gay marriage, by the way. Uh, Ron Paul doesn't support gay marriage, but he's not a fan of banning it either. So, but Ron Paul's a whole different story. I'm gonna get into that also some other time. But uh, just to give you some brief, very brief, short history on Mr. George, the guy who basically started all this, and Peter Thiel, by the way, and Robert George are friends and. Uh, Peter Thale is the guy who introduced him to all of this uh, neocon uh, bullshit. And he is a big operative for the Bilderberg Group. Who's the Bilderberg Group? Look it up. Google it. You'll find out. All right. Anyway, um, Nam has come out and declared National Eat at Chick-fil-A Day. National Eat at Chick-fil-A Day. Mark your calendars. is June 25th. And this is the National Organization for Marriage, the same NOM, that said that corporations should be neutral. But now, they don't have to be neutral. <laughs> Fucking hypocrites. No, I mean, the worst part is, you know, fine, if you're against gay marriage... We'll battle things out, right? I mean, I don't like the battle. I don't like these wars because they distract from the real issues that we as a country are facing. But I do think that gay people should have the same economic 
<clears throat> rights as anybody else. The same economic opportunities and securities that the courts protect uh, or the, the courts offer. But again, like I said earlier, marriage is a corporation created by the courts. The real marriage part where you fall in love and you and you and you and you hitch up and you shack it up together, that's natural marriage. That's when you just do it, right? But the corporation part, which is what we're fighting over, I mean, uh, the corporate laws dealing with marriage are so persuasive, are so in our lives that gay people have no other choice but to fight for these economic rights. And I understand that. So that's just one point. But the National Organization for Marriage, uh, corporate neutrality, that's what they're claiming. Now they're saying that June 25th, mark your calendars, is National Eat at Chick-fil-A Day. All right. I thought that those who supported gay marriage are what? Big fat cats. That's what Brian Brown, the that stupid fucking airhead who operates National Organization for Marriage. That's what he said, right? People who support gay marriage are fat cats. And yet he's giving more money to the to a big fat cat which is Dan Cathy that guy's worth millions the company which is privately owned is worth a lot of a lot of money by the way it's close to a billion or more than that actually I'm not even sure but I think it's in the billions now this company is worth and <clears throat> Brian Brown says that gay people are being supported by big fat cats and Wall Street even though Robert George, who hangs out with big fat cats and white shoe boys and hangs out with people like uh, Mittens Romney, who is nothing but a big fat cat himself, right? Mitt Romney, who is being supported by Nam, who is a hedge fund hyena, who who likes to s strip away assets of private companies and, and break down companies and break down their stocks so, so he can buy them up. This guy, Mittens Romney, he's a really bad deal for for this country but nom the national organization for marriage who is now hosting this eat at chick-fil-a day right they love mittens romney oh they love mittens 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 so i hope you have some money left over and join the national organization for marriage right and look how they put it out i mean this is what they said uh, this is the email that they or the uh, post on their on their blog that was sent to supporters. Dear marriage supporter, <laughs> you mean dear anti-gay marriage supporter? Thanks to your recent efforts at dumpstarbucks.com, which gain nothing, right? Only uh, what like thirty thousand people actually signed up for that crap, and dump General Mills. Only what like ten people show up to that protest? <laughs> oh God. Oh, God, what a bunch of fucking losers. <laughs> Jeez. Jesus Christ. You know what? I'm done. I'm going to end this right now. But Chick-fil-A National Eat at Chick-fil-A Day. Sponsored by Nam, who says that corporations should be neutral on the gay marriage issue. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's what they're doing now, right? That's what they're saying. That's how being neutral is. It's to sponsor a national Eat at Chick-fil-A Day. Eat at Chick-fil-A. It's good for you. Good for marriage. That's what they're saying. What a bunch of dumb fucks. Anyways, I'm Jose Soto. Hope you enjoyed today's show. I'll see you next time. Thanks for listening.